start with a ball, start shaping it into sort of a cylindrical shape, and then we're gonna take it to the table. Now that happens a lot. So one side is thinner and the other side is thicker and you're just gonna tap it out and keep going. I actually want this to be like flat on the sides, on all the sides. Um, so I'm gonna take water. You need a generous amount of water. I'm gonna start going like this. I'm squeezing with two hands, I'm sorry, two fingers like this. And I'm stretching the clay along the top. A little bit of pressure. You can rotate this so this way it's gonna come out even. It can't just go, you can't just cut straight down and then hope that this, this joint will stick and be strong enough like that. So I need to see like how, how much of this, uh, let's start by cutting off the top. So I'm gonna slice this and I'll show you from the side. Um, Gotta go this way. Gotta go diagonal this way. You see that? This edge now, you see that? Is going to the flat part, will attach to the side of the mug like that. So I'm gonna cut down at an angle like this, okay? And then it'll attach like this. It'll come up. And then I'm just taking a measurement right now to see how far down it's going to come. Okay, so uh, let's say about here. At an angle this way. So if I open this up, this angle goes like this, this cut, and now this cut at the bottom is going to go in this direction, in this direction, so they're sort of like that, okay? I'm going to wet here, wet here, I'm going to scratch, use the pin tool, I'm going to scratch. So you actually want this, um, the rest of the mug to be pretty, um, not completely dry, but pretty dry. A little bit more water, because like I'm able to pick it up and put pressure on it, so this is good. On those angled cuts, the top one, I'm gonna scratch here, and then I'm gonna flip this to the inside. Bit of water. Now I'm going to take this and I'm going to push real good against the mug. Push real good. Oh my gosh. And then, even while it's here, I'm going to sort of judge this underneath while I have really good access. And then attach here at the bottom like that. So you have uh, okay, and then you need. good clay. I'm just going to make sure I support underneath it while I smooth this out. A lot of times you really just need to let this dry a little bit.
And the same thing on the bottom. I'm actually going to get rid of some of this, really shave some of this off. I'm going to zhuzh, ooh, really get rid of some of that. There we go. It's too thick. And then, go like that. And then, make sure the shape is the way I want it. You can use a sponge or the brush. So while this dries, you can actually stuff this wrap the entire thing so this way it won't fall. You know, you want this handle to sort of hold up and stay in its place so you can do it that way too. Okay, handle number two, you're going to start off with a ball. So this one I'll use just a coil. 